And the understanding of also, you know, the time you spent individually in groups. So there's times you spent, you know, I think about now with the two boys and how much you can tell that they relish when it's, they like being with the other, but they like one-on-one. -on -one. They like it being about them. And I think, I think more about the times I spent with Dad are always individual things. Things I remember fondly, all those things that we did with my brothers, but it was when Dad took me here or we did that together. Or, um, when we were kids living in, we lived in Fiji for a little while and my brothers were at school and I was spending more time with Dad and they went for, to a different school. And we would hang out every day and get on the bus, go to the market. And that was an extraordinary experience for both of us, I think, and, and one we always talk about fondly. And, and if we hadn't had that trip, I would never have spent that much time with him. And, you know, and that, that time you spend as a kid sort of, it influences the way your relationship is as an adult. And it's not, it's not that I've had a perfect relationship with my father, but I've had it, I've always looked in terms of it being my responsibility to maintain the relationship and in order for me to become sort of mentally strong about that and never have any regrets about anything is that's my responsibility, not his. And so I, you know, we've done some great things together, you know, I, for his 70th birthday, I took him to Easter Island. And he'd always, because he'd always wanted to go. And that was awesome. We had a great time together. And that was, uh, that was more about me than it was about him, I reckon. 